Hello Atonement, got um, an exciting update for you on how we are going to be doing church in this season and uh, how we're responding to coronavirus. The video didn't work for, for it, but the audio did and the message definitely did, I hope. So check this video out right now. Excited to share with you all some uh, recent uh, news, an update in this season of COVID-19 regarding safe gatherings for small groups outdoors mm -hmm. and um, you can read those procedures at our website but I do want to thank Jeannie Coughlin and Joy Elber, Kurt Trader who are supporting our uh, church officers and staff in creating these uh, the guidance for these safe procedures whether it's at our patio as pictured here or at our outdoor worship center our playground and uh, even in our memory garden can accommodate safe distancing for some small great groups. Please do follow the safety procedures that we've prepared and do let us know if we can uh, answer any questions. But these procedures uh, and the guidance is effective immediately. Kevin? Yeah, thanks Pastor Greg. Um, we wanna continue to carefully evaluate procedures so we can return as safely and as quickly as possible. Our next step to returning back to more normal um, church life will be to gather for outdoor worship. We're hoping to do that in July, um, but we know that we're gonna be making decisions based around data, not just around set dates. We're gonna to continue to um, pay attention to coronavirus um, spread, particularly in Southeast Wisconsin, and pay attention to when um, it seems uh, safe and appropriate to do that. We're, we're really wanting this to be soon, um, but we also wanna be safe uh, with that. And we're excited to announce, in the meantime, though, we're going to have a new um, way to stream worship starting June 21st. That's two Sundays from now. We're going to be streaming worship from our sanctuary, um, and that worship will include Holy Communion. So you will be able to watch you know, one video, and it will be the full service um, together. And we're really excited about that, and I hope you enjoy worshiping with us in that way. We'll have more directions coming about how we will be doing communion and how you can participate in communion with us over our stream. And I want to express thanks lastly to Chris Kent, to Katie Klinert, and Marlo Parada. They put in a lot of work to make this really exciting new way to do worship possible. Um, look forward to, to worshiping with you in a slightly different way in two weeks. 